Instagram on a Galaxy S24 may freeze due to insufficient storage space from overloaded apps or due to slow or unstable Wi-Fi or cellular data causing app malfunctions. If you have a problem like this, the first thing you should do is to force stop Instagram and reopen it. This can help resolve issues like freezing or crashing by terminating the app's current instance and clearing its potentially corrupted cache. To do it, tap the recent app's key at the bottom of the screen. Look for Instagram's preview card and then swipe up to close it. After that, launch the app again to see if it still freezes at some point. If the problem persists, then you should restart your phone. This action essentially gives your device a fresh start, which can often resolve app-related issues like freezing or crashing. So press and hold the volume down and power buttons for a couple seconds. When the power menu shows, tap restart and then confirm it. After the reboot, launch Instagram again to know if the problem is fixed or not. Another thing you have to do to fix this issue is to clear Instagram's cache and data. This essentially resets the app's stored data, which can often fix problems like freezing, crashing, and other performance issues. To do it, tap and hold the app's icon until the menu shows. Tap the app info icon. On the next screen, tap storage and then tap clear cache. After that, tap clear data and confirm it by tapping delete. Once you've done that, launch the app again and see if the problem is fixed. If still not, then you need to reinstall the app. This can help resolve persistent issues by removing the current version of the app, which might have bugs or corrupted files. So tap and hold the app's icon until the menu shows again. This time, tap uninstall and then select OK to confirm. Once the app is uninstalled, launch the Play Store and search for Instagram. Now download it and wait until it's installed. After that, Instagram should work properly and that's how you fix Instagram that freezes on your Galaxy S24. We hope that this tutorial can help you. Thanks for watching.